keeping up with our motto, let learning be a joy and teaching a pleasure. Here we are with the remote teaching and learning process to bridge the gap. Happy learning, students. Welcome dear students. I hope you all are doing well. Let's learn some new terms and figures in part 2 of Mathematics, chapter 1. Before beginning with new topic, we'll do some revision or you can say recap of the what we have studied in part 1 of the same lesson. Yes, what is an angle and its types? That is acute angle, right angle and obtuse angle. Remember students? Good. Recall your memories? Yes. We also studied the parts of a circle. That is radius, center, diameter, circumference and a chord. Now, students let's see some basic geometrical shapes. Here they are. A triangle, a circle, a rectangle and a square. You all have said it in center 3. Let's start. What is it? A triangle. Look at the figure carefully. What it shows? Yes, it shows corner. Now what is corner? It is the point with two sides or edges meet. A corner is also called as a vertex. Vertex A, Vertex B and Vertex C. A triangle has three vertices. Vertex is a singular form and vertices is a plural form of vertex. Check out in this figure. Yes, Vertex A vertex B and C with its sides. Here you can see sides name. Yes. Sides means and edges of the figure. Look here. Side AB, side BC, side AC. You can write sides name clockwise or anti-clockwise. Here we go with the next figure. Yes. This is a square. It has four vertices and four sides. Let's write its name. Side PQ, side QR, side RS and side PS. So, a square has four vertices and four sides. Okay, this is a rectangle. Let's count how many sides it has. It has four sides and four vertices. Sides names are side LM, side MN, side NO, side LO. Children, today we are studying the new concept of writing names of sides of the given figures. Let's see in this table. We have three different figures. Answers are also given. Check out the answer column. Names of sides. Take the first figure, yes, triangle P, Q, R. Its sides are side P, Q, side Q, R and side P, R. Same way you can write the names of the sides for rectangle, side A, B, side B, C, side C, D and side A, D. Same for the square, yes, side U, V, side V, W side WX and side UX. Remember students, while writing the names of the side, the word side is compulsory to write down before the letters. That is S-I-D-E side and then write the letter P-Q, side P-Q. Okay. We have the same figures but in this table, we are going to write the names of the vertices. Yes, for triangle PQR, the names are P, Q, R, Yes, comma is compulsory between the two letters when we write the names of the vertices. 
like write the names of the vertices of rectangle a b c d yes a comma b comma c comma d for the square u comma v comma w comma x you all have clear with the concept student yes now be ready for the homework time i hope you all are clear with the concept let's do some homework draw the rough figures of the rectangle triangle and square give proper name to the figure done good do the practice of the sums today we have completed chapter 1 of maths keep learning students